Hey, what's up, guys? It's DTG here, and we're back for another episode of Mass Effect 3. Last time we left off, we met with Mr. Fist, and that didn't go so well. We actually killed Mr. Fist. Well, I didn't. I didn't kill Mr. Fist, but Rex, Rex killed Mr. Fist. We found out through Mr. Fix 2 that Sarah was going to set up his his Corian, which is Miss Talia right here, tech specialist. And we saved her because she does have information on Saren. And we also found out that there may be Reapers involved. So, with that being said, we have more than just the gift to worry about. I'm not really too sure what the Reapers are, but we know they're like the endangered species. They're cuckoo, and they want to destroy the world. And Saren's with it. We're not with it. So, now we're going to go to the... The council and we're gonna go check out and see what the people have to say for this hopefully they actually understand okay, let's go. excuse me commander shepherd could you spare a moment of your time oh real quick real quick real quick real quick um i went ahead and upgraded talia she's looking like pistols and shotgun is her only weapons but she's more like machines so she does more technical da damage so we'll see how that goes over time, but I don't really like it. You know, I love Ashley, but eventually we're gonna have to try out different people too, just to see how they, how well they work with each other. Um. Oh my God, what is all this? Armor upgrade, armor upgrade, weapon upgrade, ammo upgrade. Wait. Oh. Hey. Wait, 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 wait. Uh oh. I don't know what I had equipped for. Oh, God. Physique rounds, hammerhead rounds, 25% weapon force, and 20 versus organics, 20 versus synthetic. Uh, I'll just give you that, I guess. Oh, I just look at details, so I don't have to keep switching it out. So, I mean, use German technology. Okay. Alia, um, you're, you're a pistol weirdo, so I guess I'll give you, you can strike two, and I'm going to upgrade that for you. Hmm, I'll give you hammerhead rounds. I got the cheesy pistol rounds. You know, Commander Shepard's got to have the best of the best. So there's my Okay. Yeah. Anyway, let's see what Samish Bhatia has to say. Commander Shepard, my name is Samish Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. What is it? A lot of people want my help these days. What makes you special? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. Wait, the 212? Your wife was serviceman Narali Bhatia. I'm Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams. I served in her unit. Chief Williams, it is a pleasure. Nirali spoke of you with great respect. I'm so sorry for your loss, Mr. Bhatia. Nirali was a good sorry. woman. What can we do for you? I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. That's tough. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. I'll find out. We'll look into it. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. We when I last saw him, he was in the out. expensive we bar over there. Out. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. And she will get that. She will definitely get that. Let's Oh my god, stop pulling out your weapons, Commander. Alright, let's see. Citadel Homecoming. Speak to Bosker, the diplomat handling Mr. Bayou's situation. Find out why his wife's body has not returned. He is in the embassy lounge in the presidential. Is there like a. Wait, is this him? Bosky? Okay, here we go. Alright, where. Is this me? Okay. Alright, so we need to turn around and go up these steps. But, how are you guys doing today? 
today is a beautiful day outside to get some sunlight but me personally my allergy sucks so i don't want to go outside clerk bosker he looks like a bum my goodness you're commander shepherd your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps is there something i can do to assist you yes stop stealing corpses you weirdo and you know matter of fact give me the corpse while i'm in it you can cut the red tape for a grieving husband i want you to release the body of nirali Bacha. commander nothing would make me happier i'm afraid though that it's not quite that simple your lips serviceman are nirali Bhatia died on eden prime as mr Bhatia no doubt and told you telling you. me it's not that simple her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. She's been mauled? I don't care how badly the Geth mangled the body. It's the husband's right to claim her. We are not holding Nirali Bhatia's body out of discretion. Research? We are, frankly, holding the body for research. So this is what we do? We research on people? The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. That's weird, bro. Respectfully, serviceman Bhatia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Hmm. You know, I don't have to be evil every time, but let's see, like, the length of How the research. How long do you think the research is going to take? This is a long-term study. I wouldn't expect the bodies to be released for a year or longer. When will this research result in actual new technology? If we're lucky, we'll actually realize usable technology from this study in a few years. What about the number of bodies? You've got to have a lot too. of bodies. Can't you release one? Very few bodies had this new type of weapon damage, and very few were in good enough condition to This study. might help us against the Geth, Beyond though. that, Commander, we need as many bodies as we can to get a reasonable sample mm. size. I'll tell Samesh. Next time you cut up a dead soldier, at least tell her husband the truth. That was just the reaction we were hoping to avoid, Commander. But if you think it will help, tell Mr. Batia the truth. Perhaps he will understand. Please let me know if you have any other questions. You better hope he understands before I come back. I just leveled up again. Is leveling up in this game like if anyone's like played this one? Is leveling up like pretty easy? Like Jesus. Mm, I don't think I need to increase biotic protection. Me personally, I want to go for shotguns, but I guess that's I guess that's not the move right now. Advanced warp. Lowers target. I thought he does that anyway. He's just oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Mm. Tactical armor. We like less damage. Let's go ahead and thank you. Um, Ashley. You know what we going for? And Talia. I'm just gonna go ahead and give you this. I want you to go ahead and have that. All right. Cool. Let's go and let Mr. Dumas know. Is that his name? Mr. Banish. I hope that's his name. And if I'm saying it wrong, I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. And I Hello, Commander. I think Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosco? Be pretty good. Will you return my wife's body? Vegetable. I have a few favorites, but broccoli casserole is like all time high. They're running medical studies on Norelli. That's why they won't release the body. Tests? They're holding my wife's body for tests? My wife served the Alliance faithfully. I she gave her. her life for humanity. And this is how they repay her. This is war. Samesh, right now more people are going to die unless the military runs those tests. This isn't about them. This is about my wife. The woman the military killed. The military didn't kill her, though. Man, you know, I'm gonna be sent to him. The Geth killed your wife, and they'll kill a lot more if we don't run those tests. You think I've not given enough? Don't speak to me of duty. My wife is dead. Yeah. Yes, she is, Mr. Batia. She died, she died by the fighting why for what she you, believed why in. Why won't you be okay with this? She sacrificed her life to keep you safe. I think she'd want to make the most of that sacrifice. You're right, Miss Williams. Oh yeah, she would not uh, finish from her the duty. Let them run the their tests. Hey, Let my wife saved lives and others are spared the loss I feel today. Slowly but surely, Goodbye. trying to get up there, man. Roll to fifty subscribers. Thank you Road for finding the answers. 
Y'all need to like, comment, and subscribe, man. It's free. It ain't hurting nobody. And who don't who don't enjoy a chill session? I know I do for sure. I know I do for sure. Uh, let's see. Where's next? I guess we need to go. We need to go to the capital. Residential city of tower because we need to let them know about Saren. Saren is evil. We've got proof now. We've saved Talizora. And let's see. Hopefully they make us a spectra, right? Because they do, we can travel and go after Come on. Them. Udina's presenting the Quarian's evidence to the council. Okay. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You nah. wanted proof? Nah, they don't believe this. I know some of This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's that? Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. Saren, yeah, he is trying to bring them back. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, mm. and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. But he failed, though. Do we even though. know what this Conduit is? No, it's trouble. No, we don't know. It's trouble. Saren thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. Don't be a fool. Like, this... Okay. Let's, let's have some logical conversations right now. If Saren just attacked Eden Prime, and he was happy with that, and now he's not here... What does that mean? The Gef is the Gef, right? They're trying to revive the Reapers. Can we please have some type of common sense? Some type of common sense. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same Thank mistake you, again. Commander, please. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. We need more information. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true hey, purpose. He gonna be the first one to die. Using to bend the Geth to his will. You're wrong. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. Okay, that doesn't that change is nothing. not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! Send the dogs in. A fleet cannot track down one man. Oh, but Commander can. The Citadel fleet could secure the entire region. Keep the Geth from attacking Send any more of our us colonies. right now. Send or it us. could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Send me. This is perfect. Send, send, send the Commander. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. Yes. No. It's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibility. Do you want to die or do you want to? It is the best solution. I'm not even gonna like be like quit holding us back. It is the best solution. You don't have to send a fleet into the traverse. See, I can and be, the ambassador gets his human spec. I could be. I could be happy. I could. I could be understanding. It's two sides to a story. Yeah. Go ahead, give me that statue. Commander Shepard, step forward. Yes, sir. Yes. 
Humanity has risen again. The people will know that humanity has saved Earth. It is the decision the of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Yes, sir. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, we are the embodiment the of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. I hope they are protectors first, of bro. galactic peace. He, he's already both our first thing. and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. About time. I ain't gonna do all that. What's my first mission? We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate. Any leads? Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. Yes, sir. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Yes, sir. I am now a Spectre. Spectre. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy special and speak training. to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Are you telling Anderson, me those aren't the skills that I have? I need your help to set all this up. Mm. Good I stuff. thought the ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. I know, Talia. That's weird, ain't it? But guess what, though? What do you expect from a politician? Let's come on. Right behind you, Commander. I already know. Spectre bonus. Spectre training talent unlocked. Whoa. Spectra training. What's this? Elite agents of the council. The Spectres have access to special training unavailable elsewhere in the galaxy. Increased health, accuracy, and effectiveness of all attacks and powers. Grants unity ability. Increase the damage and duration of all your powers and attacks by 1%. What the? What is unity? Restore dead squadmates with 30% health and 50 shields. We're going for it. We'll take all that we can get. Cause playing on hard mode, I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be easy. We're gonna have some deaths. That's just how it is. But we need to go to CSEC right now. So while we're doing that, go ahead and give you a little little more backstory on the story time if you watched the last episode. Remember guys, we don't like dirty we don't like dirty remakes at all if you have a dirty roommate please let them know immediately tell them they need to learn how to clean asap it's just not it bro and i'm not i'm not acting i'm not gonna be acting like i'm the cleanest okay um i'm not gonna be acting like i was i used i'm just the cleanest person in the world but what I won't stand for is just food with me, bro. I mean, this, this just not it. The ambassador will provide you a ship and food. Meet him at the Alliance docking bay. Send me through the central elevator. Oh, gotta go through the elevator. Okay. Where is he? Oh. Bro, I'm just telling y'all, like. Did everybody get two points? Oh, snap. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, what did she get for this one? Advanced overkill. Firing assault rifles generate 90% less heat and does 75 more damage. Maybe the next one. Because I want her to get this because next shot will inflict damage equal to 200% of weapon damage per BTS. So basically, she's from Okay. I see where I want to go with this. I'm going to go ahead and give her AI hacking. Lowers recharge of ability. Sabotage, overlord, and damping. I don't have damn. Uh, I'm gonna give her. All right, get in here, y'all. In other news, Exogenic Corp so, is still denying reports that one of their like survey said, teams has gone I'm missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. I may have been the cleanest person growing up. When asked why but communication with the survey team was suddenly better. cut off and last week, company officials refused I to deal comment. With it. Can't deal with it, bro. I cannot. If you like clean, keep it clean. 
that's also just on the group of people you hang with too. If you hang with dirty people, you're gonna be dirty. If you hang with clean people, you're gonna be clean. Point blank simple. I don't really talk about it. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the what? Nova. The ship is yours now. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. Forced retirement. <laughs> time to put the time to put the cape up. This man. isn't right. The Normandy belongs to you. You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Oh, yeah, I believe there's more to this, but right now we're not too worried about that. We need we need Saren on the What kind of watch do we right have? now? Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got us Geth scouring the traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony okay. there dropped out of contact, and there have been sightings around Noveria. Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. What about the Reapers? The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key Why to bringing Captain them back. Why is Captain Anderson the only person who stop believes this? I believe, there's some, the I believe they're trying to keep something stop hidden. The Reapers hidden. From returning. Wait, I got it, bro. I'll stop it. I got it. We would definitely stop we it. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist, who specializes in the Protheans. Oh. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. Dr. We Dr. have reports Sorry. she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau hmm. cluster. Well, I guess we could go We could go check out the Geth. They're in both these regions, but it's probably important we get another Maybe she could be another party member, so it'd probably be important to check her out. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. But your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. That's your job. I, I really don't care. Y'all want me, y'all pick me for a reason and it's gonna get done regardless. I'll take care of Sarah. You take care of the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I'm a Spectre now. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Alright, Commander. Tell me what I need to know. Yes, Commander? You and Saren have a pass. Tell me what happened with you and Saren 20 years ago. It's close to 20 years ago now. Ambassador Goyle was our representative here on the Citadel. Okay. Like Udina, she wanted to get a human into the Spectres. She chose me. Okay. The Council sent Saren to keep an eye on me and evaluate my performance, just like they sent Nihilus to keep tabs on you. What happened? I think I deserve the whole story. Yeah. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. Oh. Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. Okay. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. Mm. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. Something went wrong though, what? I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. That sounded like a good plan. I'm pretty sure somebody got hurt. He was smart. He needed a diversion. This went way beyond a simple diversion, Commander. Really? The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside he killed them with poison? There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mostly civilians. Best. Oh. Sarah didn't care. The target was eliminated. Mission accomplished. And I ended up taking the blame. Aw, oh, man. That ended all talk of me joining the Spectre. That's, that's lame, bro. That's so lame. Hey, we're going to get Saren. Saren caused real. the explosion. How'd he pin it on you? But that's a good In question. In report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for us. What? He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. 
Saren's report was all the proof the council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. That's not cool. Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a well, bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. Mm. Get about it, bro. It is what it is. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. It's no good living in the past. I should go. Right, I'll be go. here if you need anything. What's up here? Let's just see what's up here. Okay. The Normandy. The Normandy. Let's check the codex out. Uh, let's see. Nothing that's nothing that's telling me anything there. Cool. Alright. We got our own ship. Stand by shore party. Decontamination in progress. Mm-hmm. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. The only thing I don't really like about Ashley, she don't really have down by backroom politics. Just watch right, your back, Joker. Commander. Things go bad on this Joker. mission, you're next on the chopping block. I play Persona, one. Joker, you know? I'm thinking about adding that Persona into the rotation. I'm not sure yet. Saren's out there somewhere. And we're gonna find a load of persona Everyone series, on this ship's on three or five. Man, I played. Intercom's open. If you got anything to say to the crew, now's the time. We do things my way. Listen up, Normandy. This is your commander speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. And I refuse to let anything get in the way of that mission. The council wants to ignore this. That's no surprise. They've never helped us in the past. No reason they'd start now. But we don't need their help. We can do this on our own. We all know what happened on Eden Prime. We saw the destruction, we saw the bodies, we saw what Saren did. And I plan to make him pay. We, there is no failure. This is the most important mission any of us have ever been on. This is above anyone's pay The fate grade. of an entire galaxy is at stake. Ashley we will stop Harris. Saren, no matter what the cost. Where's Talia? Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. Man, guess what though? He don't matter anymore. The captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. Let's go, bro. Yes, sir. I like how he's just like, oh, we're gonna do it, and he just stop all the same. That's kind of <laughs> Navigator Presley. If anyone has to take over for Captain Anderson, I'm glad it's you. I'm not sure about having non-humans on our ship, though. What? You doubt my decisions? I'm in charge here, Presley. I decide if we have non-humans on this vessel. Yes, sir. Understood, sir. Carry on, Presley. What? Yes, Presley? sir. How dare you? If you ain't going out there with me, then go ahead and be quiet. All right. So this is the Citadel. Let's zoom out. see nothing okay here we go so we got asteroid x57 novera pharaohs so this is the galaxy it looks very good dude please i'm just trying to please all right so we got four places. I don't even know what's on asteroid X57, but I say let's go ahead and go to the dig site. I believe that's going to be the first choice. Gnosis, Athens. Maybe I should read. Yeah, let's travel to another system. Okay, that's weird. That's so weird. I think I like doing the listening to story time. Very like very interesting. Um Ooh. Fatos. Okay, 
let's back out because we're in the right area, but we don't. I don't know. Okay. Liara Tasani in Sarki Arculus, famed for her knowledge of the Protheans, is being sought by Siren. Her last known location was somewhere. Explore the uncharted worlds of Artemis too close to find Liara. Oh, we just gotta. We just gotta go in there. Okay. Mm. If I was a scientist, where would I go? Close investigator here, there's millions of elaborate cribs of humans below the surface. Okay, I don't really know how Trace is a small terrestrial with a trace of atmosphere. The surface is scorching hot. Or would appear 0.3 Earth years. Jesus. So we're just supposed to know where is how would I know where she's Oh, the Romeo is a distant but rich industrial world claimed by the Human Systems Alliance. It is plentiful. Heavy metals have fueled the recent manufacturing boom of Earth. Core samples rich with fossils of simple silicone-based organisms indicate Therum has been more habitable in the past than it is at the present. Perhaps this explains the many Prothean ruins down the surface, most of which have been looted by mining corporations. Oh, let's check this out. Okay, um, ooh. I think, um, let's, let's, I'm gonna take Ashley, and I need somebody with take, so I'm gonna take out, let's do it. Talia and Ashley, let's see how you guys are. Okay, so what are we doing? Commander, I'm picking up some strange readings. Really strange, like off the damn charts. It looks like it's coming from an underground complex a few clicks away from the drop zone. Underground complex. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh my god, what the freak is that? Got a missile? I was gonna say, can I go in the lava? I probably got Okay, so this world looks pretty screwed up. The Joker got a reading. He clicked, so let's see. Let's see what's really going on. Look, he making me a little nervous. I'm like, where are we supposed to go? I guess we'll see. You know, the planet looks a little deserted. But. I don't know. Graphics are pretty good, though. Would y'all be driving across this planet just to, like, to look for one person? I was like. Wait, what's that red? Uh oh. I'm not exit marking this part. Yo, what's that? What the heck is that? Alien? Yeah. Oh, these are amateur gifts. Okay, okay. Yeah, if you think I'm gonna get out the car. That was easy. Alright, so we might we're definitely in the right place. Get for attacking this. We are definitely in the right place. Honestly, I might as well just stay in the car. I think this is more convenient. Logo. We got height and cover. Look at me cheesing the system. So 
there's a no go there. I, are they above this? They brought the no go. Yeah, fight cover. That was easy. She said they have height, but where are they? Oh, there they go. Why wouldn't? Why would I get out the car if this is the most cheesy method? This is the cheesy method. Why would I get out the car? I'm gonna make my life so much easier. Why would I get out the car? You see how convenient this is, like. Yeah, if you honestly think I'm gonna get out the car. <laughs> Yo! Yo, that man's getting cooked. Yo, he's glitching, he's glitching. Okay, maybe, all right, maybe we can get out now. All right, let's go. Everyone's got their stuff out. Um, I don't really want you to have a sniper right now. Go back to this and follow you. Just go pissed up right now. Alright, Ashley, go check it out in there. Barrier uh, throw. How do you just use your power by itself? Okay, that was easy. That was really easy, actually. Ooh, better sniper rifles? Why not? I got two level ups. Me personally, I really want to start working on lift, but this is really good. This is, that's really good. I'm gonna go ahead and get that. And it's assassination. Ooh, hey, hey, I'm building some. I'm building them, bro. I'm gonna keep building. Shield regenerator, radioactive rounds, armor plating, improved sighting, high caliber motorized joints. Okay. Gate control. What did that do? Oh, it opened the route for us. Okay. Cool, so I guess we'll now be getting into more gameplay instead of just a lot of story. So I think I'm gonna stop. I think I'm gonna stop here. And next time we're gonna explore this. We're gonna explore the area. And this is Theorem, so we're gonna explore Theorem. And it looks like there's there's more to be found over here. I haven't checked out the other area, but we'll check that out in a second. Oh wait, I just replaced it over here. Okay, but yeah, there's more area to check out. We'll check that out next time. And what I'm gonna do also, just to like save time. I'm not sure if y'all really care about watching me upgrade my characters or just putting different equipment on. But the next episode, what I'll just do, I'll just go ahead and put this stuff on and just explain why I did what I did. And you know, like for example, ooh, can't talk today. For example, she has the Reaper 1, but I, I thought I just found the Reaper 2. I did. But the hammer is good too. The hammer is a common sniper rifle designed to overwhelm active defense. It fires in three round bursts with low accuracy. That wouldn't really be good for her. I need her to be like. The Reaper is a heavy sniper rifle made by Ecos. This entry level is powerful, slow fire, and has lower accuracy than other sniper rifles. Yeah, but me personally, I don't want her with the high damage input. So, and this looks like this looks like it'd be it looks like it pretty good. So I'm gonna give her the hammer, and we have multiple stuff. So I'll give you, I might give you like the 
Reaper one. And me, I'm probably gonna get the Reaper two. Uh, nobody got the armor. Yeah, I'm gonna get the armor. So, we'll see how that goes. But next time, I'll I have everyone upgraded with their gear and stuff, and then. We'll see how that goes. I may do a little bit more of a story time, a new one, or the same one. Just depends on how I'm feeling. And I'm beginning out more content for you guys, more shorts as well. Roll to roll to 20 so far. I mean, I think I said 50 earlier, but roll to 20. And if you guys enjoy, please like, comment, and subscribe. It is surely free. DTG here, Des the Gamer, you know, type stuff. Got the game here. We're gonna explore next episode. See you guys later, and you guys have a wonderful day. Peace.